9, 8, 7. Camilo Sanchez, Paquito is his name. Second in qualifier. And when it comes to the steep stairs, there's few faster. Three seconds up and split. One in Valparaiso. On the short travel bike here. And look how he is pinning it on it. And he is absolutely risking it all out. Attack it. He wants that win. He wants it. He was close to it in Medellin. Crashed out. He did. Still came in 12th, fourth around one. Maybe, uh, maybe a little aggressive into that turn. They're stalled in the corner a little bit. But look at the pace of it. Almost not watch it. He's on an enduro. He's on an enduro bike. You shouldn't be going that way. He's up by nearly a second. Wow. Look at this from Camilo Sanchez. This is insane. On that bike, this is insane. This is insanity to ride those stairs like that. Those last two riders are, oh, this is, this was a mixed up out of that house, but then the exit was super fast. I think he's gonna extend that lead. Point one, he is out. Second. Over two seconds now then. Look at this from Sanchez, the Colombian. The altitude will bother these riders less. From Manizales in Colombia. Losing a little bit in the key section. But not much. But not to twitch up. No, not to go to so either. Yeah, exactly. Goldstone, no. no. <laughs> Sorry. No, you go, Kaga. <laughs> it's so exciting to watch these guys sprinting it on the flyer, doing a nothing wrong. Nearly three seconds now, then, for Camilo Sanchez. Can he win one of these things? The last round. This is going to be a proper threat to Velez. And this is going to be the comparison between the Endura bike and the downhill bike. One in Montserrat Cup last year. stairs and full power and all the pedal sections well done is it gonna be enough though See, here on the first stair section not hesitating at all corner speed insane wow what a race what a final round of Red Bull Sano Abajo, this. What amazes me, though, is on the finish sprint, he was not actually faster than Goldstone. He actually lost a yes. little bit of time to Goldstone. But look at the effort he put up further up, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Got to take its toll, maybe. At this altitude, I know the Colombians perhaps more used to it, more conditioned for the thin air, the rarefied air. Look how quick he went down there. It's in sight. Both wheels sliding on those stairs, and he just holds it wide open. Look. Taking so much risk on those stairs with the big bike, with the small bike, with the light bike. The South Americans own the streets in these urban downhills.